some fishing this morning for bass and pike. All right, guys, we just arrived at our fishing spot right here. We got a bass, we go, yeah. Well, guys, not bad when you have diamonds. So. Got one, got one, got a fish. Hello guys, SW Outdoors. Hope you guys are actually having a fantastic day today. Um, we are heading out to the dried up lake and it's not even dried up yet. Uh, we're going to be doing some fishing this morning for bass and pike. So I got my pike lures with me and I got my uh, trusty old bass lures. So we're going to try fishing this morning for a few hours before I have to go to work this afternoon. And hopefully the fish are biting this morning. It's a little cooler this morning. So I don't know how the barometric pressure is going to handle the fishing earlier this morning, but as the morning drags on, I'm hoping to get a little bit of action this morning, hopefully. I went out last night, nothing was biting, but uh, hopefully today that changes the little game a little bit. So either ways, guys, let's get out there and see if we can catch some fish this morning. Y'all stay tuned. All right, guys, we just arrived to our fishing spot right here. Uh, this is the dried up lake right now, and it's full of water. It's not even dried up yet, but this is the lake where I do a lot of bass fishing and pike fishing. And uh, in the fall, I do a lot of goose and duck hunting out here. So this is like a public lake. But usually every summer it dries up, and then we have these like little ponds that are, are nearby the whole area. So this is going to be a excellent spot for bass and pike. There's definitely a lot of bass in this lake, so... We're gonna try our first tactic, is using my five of diamonds to catch some Oh, got a fish, 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 got a fish. Oh, we got a bass, we got a bass, we got a bass, we go, yeah. Woo! Ah. Ah. First largie of the day. Not the species we're looking for in the five of diamonds, but I guess it's a start. Ah. You know what, guys, not a big bass at all. But I was originally trying to go for a pike this morning, but it seemed like there's another lake where we're close to the honey hole in this area, but they seem to like these five of diamonds for some reason. I've noticed that for bass this year too. Like it's five of diamonds I recommend is usually the best pike lure. So I've heard, but it's also apparently the best bass lure, apparently. The lead Thompson. Well guys, not bad on the five of diamonds, but originally wanted to get a pike this morning. But nice little largemouth. But I happen to notice this year they seem to like five of diamonds. Like, yeah. So this is a little small largemouth. Nothing really big. I, I guess there's probably some bigger ones in this lake. But just this little guy happened to bite my. I thought it was a pike for a minute, but I guess it's just a little bass. So we're going to let him go. Let him go right over here. There you go, little fella. Make sure he's fine. There he goes. Yeah, he's fine. So we're gonna cast again. Right over there. Perfect cast. Got about 200 casts later. I'm probably gonna get another bass, I think, with this thing. Who's to know? Hopefully one will actually bite this line. Like I said, I want to go for a pike, but I need to figure out where the pike are on this lake. That has to be a snag right there. That was a snag, that wasn't no fish. I thought that was a fish for a minute. 
All right, guys, we're heading up the trail right now. We're going to go to another spot in the lake that I know of. Uh, this is a spot where me and my buddies did a few goose hunts last year. And the way we can get into the water is a little bit of an opening. I'm hoping there's a bit of an opening I can go out and see if there's any pike hiding out in there. So, it might be vegetated up though, but worth a shot. It's just harder to get access to these big ponds when the whole lake is full. So, we got to go walk to our spots using the ATV trail. We're hoping it's not too far away. All right, guys, I found my way to the other spot in the lake here, so we got a good spot right here. Hopefully there's just fish biting in this one little area. And there's a lot of ducks and geese out here, too. I'm going to switch to dew worms if we're not getting any luck. Pike are not going to bite, I'm just going to go switch to a regular worm, nightcrawler, and try to go for bass, because if there's no pike biting, then what's the... Oh, we got something, we got something on the line. We got something, we got something. We got something, we got something. Oh, we got a pike! 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 Woo! This is what we're looking for, guys! Woo! Woo! Ha ha! Not the size we're looking for, but it's a start. Nice little pike. Switched to another uh, spare five of diamonds that I had in my tackle box because that pike, I brought him in and yeah, I was trying to get the hook out of him, try to take a picture with him and he flopped around and the lure just went, like I was so close to the water, it's like I, he wiggled so much that yeah, he hooked my own hand with my own five of diamonds right here. If you guys can see, he didn't bite and he didn't have any teeth on him. I was just trying to get him released, but then of course, yeah, he took my good five of diamonds though. That's what I'm really pissed about. So there's definitely a pike in this lake that still has a five of diamonds in his mouth. I don't know if that fish will survive. I was just getting, trying to release him and that's what happened. But of course, there's, I know there's bigger pike in here. But that was just like, fuck, that hurt. That hurt like really bad. I think I'm going to switch to a lot of worm, go for bass now, because like I've already caught a pike today technically, but like I didn't get the footage of me. Oh, we got some, we got fish, we got fish, we got fish. Oh, little small, little, uh, well guys, um, did pretty well. Bass, a pike, and a bluegill. There we go. Did that, fish on? He on? I think he's on. I think he's on. Yeah, he's on. He's a fish. Yeah, we got a bass. We got a bass. Oh, we got a bass. Yep. Little bass. Oh, oh he just jumped right up in front of me. Woo! Yep. Yeah, just a small little bass right there. Kind of throw him back. He's going to make it. There. There he goes. Fish on. Fish on. Fish on. Fish on, fish on, fish on, fish on. That was a big bite. That was a big bite. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, what do we got here? Oh, we got one right here, right here. Oh, oh, oh. That's a big bluegill. That is the biggest bluegill I've ever caught in a while. Whew. Darn. Look at the size of this bastard. Freaking huge. There it goes. If he wants to chunk down on it, by all means. Oh, we got a big one. We got a big fish. Oh, 
Yeah, big fish, big fish. Actually, no. Uh, another bluegill. A small little sunfish, for the looks of it. Little bluegill, there you go. So we gotta get back and get to that. Try again over here. Yeah, caught on that. Yeah, there you go. All right, get the line there. Try to catch him right again. Good cast right there. We got another fish, another fish, another fish, another fish. Oh, another bass, another bass. Smaller bass on the fight. There we go. Oh, fish, fish. Another small bass. Another small large bass. Holy shit, be careful. These fish are aggressive and I'm trying not to get caught in the spoon. Another bass. There. Fish, 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 fish. Fish on, fish on, fish on, fish on. That's a bite, that's a bass, that's a bass. Yeah, that's a big bass, that's a big bass. Yeah, that's a big bass. That's a big bass. Big, big one. That's a nice large mouth, yeah. yeah man, man. Bring him in. Whoo. Not a bad size fish. Not a bad size fish. That is not a bad sized fish at all. That's our second, that's our third largey of the day. Not too bad. This guy's right here is a very chonky bass. Like he's not very big in size, but he's chonky. <laughs> but uh, not bad. We'll throw him back in the water where he belongs. There he goes. There he goes. Hold on, I got a hook. Got one. Got one. Got a fish. It's a pike. 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 Woo. Woo. Got the species we're looking for, boys. Woo. Woo. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah. Right in the frickin' teeth! Guys, we got what we were looking for here. Got northern pike tonight. Not a bad sized pike. Woo! Second pike ever! Woo! This is a nice pike, guys. Absolutely nice pike. We're just gonna...
Well guys, not a bad day on the lake today. Caught a few bass, caught a few bluegill, caught two northern pike, which is actually incredible for a video. So I'm like dehydrated right now. I hardly had anything to drink. So I'm going to go to the store and grab myself something to drink. Anyways, I will see you guys uh, when I get stopped. So I'll see you guys in a bit. 